Hi there, my name is Hans and I'm a current uh, student at RSM. I'm Stefano Tasselli, I'm an associate professor here at the RSM in the Innovation Management Group and I'm currently the academic director of the Innovation Management Master and of the new exciting Master of Medical Business and Innovation. And I will be asking some questions about this uh, brand new program. So let's start off with the first and one. And I'm very glad to answer. <laughs> Great. <laughs> let's do this. So the first question is, who is this master for? That's a great question. So this master, the name says it all, medical business and innovation, is for students who have a background in medical sciences, biosciences, whatever related directly or indirectly to the world of medicine, biosciences, healthcare, even potentially business students with this interest who want to invest their career change, their career track in something greatly related to innovation, entrepreneurship, business, in whatever field relates to medicine, healthcare, and biosciences. It's something very new, very exciting. Mm. It's one of the few programs that do it, and we're really excited to push this idea forward and to have the first batch of great students. So let's go to the yeah. second question. What is the teaching format of this master? The teaching format is really highly interactive. There is a part of basic knowledge that goes substantially through lectures and through foundational knowledge of the topics that is covered, but then there is a lot of participation interactions. Mm. That happens through workshops, that happens through guest lecturers specifically on the topic, that happens through case studies that are adapted to the medical and biomedical field, that happens, of course, through teamwork interaction, and then it gets it even more lively with the opportunity, of course, to have an internship and to engage in a project, in a concrete project, on that specific kind of field. So we try really to combine knowledge on the topic with practical knowledge that can merge teaching and practice. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Let's go to the third one. Can I combine work with this program? Oh, that's a very good and tricky question. It's a full-time program. Hmm. That means substantially that the student must be involved full-time in the master. Of course, during the master, there are specific possibilities to engage in real work with companies. That can be done through the internship, that can be done also through your individual project that is associated with the thesis. Apart from that, we say that it's full-time, so it's not so easy to combine with a full-time job. Okay, so the fourth question is, what are the career prospects? That's the best question. That's the best That's question, I agree. we created this master. Okay. <laughs> so, COVID. Hmm. A lot of pressure in all the modern societies to guarantee people good quality of life, in particular when they get old. A lot of technology with business opportunities. All of these in healthcare, biotech, biosciences, medicine, creates a lot of opportunities, not only for scientists, but also for people in business, management, innovation, who engage with these questions. Hmm. Being an entrepreneur, being a manager, being a hybrid professional combining the scientific and the business insights. This is really what we have in mind, but also specifically in this country, but not only being a regulator, be somebody working at the intersection between institutions, even politics and business for making a better use of healthcare resources and creating new opportunities for people to experience, to engage, and to have a good use of these resources and tech for a better future and better health. Mm -hmm. So you see, it's a really broad spectrum of possible professions. Some of them are already there. Others can also be created. And it's why in particular we have tracks, one of them more for management, but the other one also for entrepreneurship mm -hmm. in this sector. Let's go to the fifth question, and that is, what makes this master at RSM unique? Well, what makes this master unique is that it's a master at RSM, but it's not only a master at RSM. It's a master that combines two top institutions in the two related fields, RSM for the business part and Erasmus MC, I point my finger towards that part yeah. of the city, 
for what concerns the medical, bioscience, biotech, and more related, broadly, healthcare-related matters. It's the first master that puts these two institutions together, two top institutions in Europe, and for us it's really a matter of being really proud of it because it's really high guarantee of quality and it's so exciting to see top people from the two institutions to work together in this. Mm. So I think it's, it's a really big element of pride for us. And then we go to the last question, which is the longest one. How does this program contribute to creating positive change? The uh, mission statement of RSM. Absolutely. There is a great contribution. The title itself, Medical, Business and Innovation. The topics, healthcare, medicine, tech, and entrepreneurship for the biosciences and healthcare. The people who come here, people who want to change the field. Mm. Innovation in this case is not just in the content, but is also new as a prospective student. You want to come here to change your career trajectory. Maybe more from a scientific to a managerial entrepreneurship background. And even more the end goal. When you are out of, it, of here as an entrepreneur, as a manager, you want to be a real changer. Towards what? Well, towards a sustainable future. Sustainable for business, of course. Sustainable for the society mm -hmm. that invests a lot of resources in this field and, of course, wants good services and high quality healthcare. But also sustainable for the end customers and in the end are the patients. So there is really a fantastic alignment with the mission of the school to be a force of policy change. Mm -hmm.